Avril Lavigne is no longer considered as a girlfriend. Maude's son proposed to the singer on March 27 in Paris, and she is now a fiancé. Lavigne announced her engagement on Instagram on Thursday, sharing photographs of her spectacular new heart-shaped diamond ring, which she paired with an appropriately pop-punk neon orange manicure. Maude proposed with a handmade sparkler from Beverly Hills jeweler X1V Carrots, a favorite of Lana Del Rey, Kylie Jenner, and Haley Baldwin. It's etched with the words high icon, which were the first words he ever said to me, and it has Maude and Avril on the inside, Levine said to people. He knew from the start that I wanted a heart-shaped diamond because we were wearing matching heart-shaped paved rings on the day we met. We've been wearing them every day since, so a heart-shaped engagement ring is only natural. I'm in love with it. On the 14 Carats website, a significantly smaller variation of the style is available for $13,250. Levine was spotted wearing the bling in a recording studio in Los Angeles on Tuesday, but she didn't wear it to the Grammys when she and Sun walked the red carpet in matching all-black ensembles. Maude included Levine on his track Flames in 2021, after which he tattooed her name on his neck. They've been inseparable ever since, smothering each other with PDA at award events and canoodling on the beach, and they've also collaborated on new music. This isn't Levine's first eye-catching engagement ring. On their anniversary in 2014, Nickelback lead singer Chad Kroger gave her a 14-karat diamond reportedly worth $350,000, and she later upgraded to a 17-karat sparkler. Levine's less famous fiancé has had his own run-ins with media fame. After abandoning his pop-punk and hardcore beginnings, he switched to rapping, creating a form of music known as hippie hop. During this time, he began to build a fandom and became entangled with a very specific brand of internet-famous L.A. Denizen. Maude's son dated actress Bella Thorne from 2017 to 2019, at a pivotal point in Thorne's life when she was establishing herself as a bit of a controversy-making former Disney child. Thorne was also dating YouTuber Tana Mongo, combining the trio into a thruple, which made their connection both significant and overshadowed. Both relationships ended in early 2019, resulting in public feuds between Thorne and both of her ex-partners. Maude's son and Mongo finally dated for a short time. Thorne and Maude's son later admitted that they may or may not have been married at one point in their lives. They did have a wedding, but the validity of the marriage appears to be in doubt. Maybe it was merely practice, like Kourtney Kardashian and Travis Barker's trek down the island Las Vegas? Maude's son, like many other white rappers of the time, is now making pop-punk music. He's frequently partnered with Machine Gun Kelly and Black Bear. On Love Sucks, he collaborated with his new fiancé. Last year, the duo produced an underappreciated duet called Flames. Levine has a colorful romantic history, having previously married some 41's Derek Wibley, dated the Hills' Brody Jenner, and most recently married Nickelback's Chad Kroger. Perhaps two bizarre romantic histories are all that is required to make Levine and Maude's son's union their most enduring yet. Hopefully, the icon's romance will not get complicated. She appears to have Maude's son wrapped around her little finger. Maude's son enlisted the help of 14 Carats designer Karen Alpert, who also happens to be BFFs with Levine, and has designed practically all of her jewels, including her two previous engagement rings, for the particular sparkler. He had the biggest smile on his face the entire time, Alpert explains to Page Six Style. He knew he really wanted to do something with hearts and have the most dazzling, biggest, flawless heart-shaped ring for her, she continues, noting that Maude and Levine both bought heart-shaped pabe rings from her before they met and have worn them every day since. They also have a connection to France and monarchy, and he also wanted it to seem like a crown, Alpert explains, so there's a lot of lovely intricacy surrounding the heart shape itself. The five-carat stone is encased in a French micro-pavé setting that bears the words high icon, the first thing Maude ever said to Levine as well as their names, bringing the creation even closer to their hearts. She loves big, and the larger the diamond, the better, Alpert says of Levine. She's not afraid to be bold. She has classic, conventional, and timeless taste. Apek Shah Kothari, chief operating officer of Rare Carrot, tells Page Six Style that heart shapes are among the most difficult diamond cuts to achieve, and she estimates the Canadian singer's ring to be worth roughly $750,000. This is something extremely unique and particular to them, Alpert adds, but it's also the best of all worlds, incorporating royalty, the sweetness of their love and hearts together, and it's also a large, gorgeous diamond. Since 2021, when they collaborated on the song Flames, the couple has been together. Maudson soon after tattooed Levine's name on the back of his neck to show his devotion. And with that being said, it's time to end our video. Are you a fan of Avril Levine? Let us know in the comments. Like this video and make sure to subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos like this. We'll see you soon in the next video.